Greetings Void Explorers, today we'd like to tell you about missile ships in Void Expanse. Ship hulls available in this category are quite different from the rest. Most of them have heavy focus towards missile hardpoints compared to other ship types. So, if you prefer long-range missile warfare and shouldn't forget gameplay style, these ships are for you. Let's start our review with the lightest ship from this category, FANG. To pilot it, you will need to learn piloting heavy frigate skill. FANG is a very fast and maneuverable missile frigate, with four hardpoints allowing to install Tier 1 missile launchers. And as these hardpoints can only be mounted with missiles, you will get a lot of firepower. But this is also a downside, as you cannot mount energy or ballistic weapons and will always have to mine the ammo. Three booster slots can be used to customize Fang a bit, so that it can better fit your current needs. This ship is best suited for a long-range warfare, where you attack from afar and then pick up what's left. Perhaps that's why it is so popular among pirates of Void Expanse. If you look for a heavier missile carrier, then try Orca. This light cruiser requires you to learn a respective skill before taking the helm as well. Perhaps Orca is one of the most customizable ships in its class as you can mount missile launchers, mines and either ballistic or energy weapons on its hardpoints. In addition to that, Orca has 6 boost slots that are quite handy in customizing your ship. So, even though missiles are the main damage dealing weapons, if you are out of ammo you can proceed fighting at close range using mines and ballistic or energy weapon of your choice. And of course, there's Aurora. This heavily armored cruiser can obliterate most of the threats in Void Expanse, provided you have enough ammo, of course. As you can see, there's a missile carrier in almost every class of ships. So if you like long-range fights, you can start using the ships mentioned before, from the very beginning of the game. You should always remember the main rule of piloting missile carriers. Mind your ammo, because if you don't, you can get yourself in a situation where you can only run from your enemies, as there's no ammo left. Use recharge consumables and don't forget to visit stations once in a while to avoid that and you will have no problems piloting these ships. That was all we wanted to tell you about missile carriers, their main pros and cons. If you have anything to share about those or want to discuss something, visit our forums. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more videos.